Developmental kyphosis, otherwise known as hunchbacking, is a condition that generally affects teenage boys, but sometimes girls, and is a condition where the normal curves of the spine become more exaggerated. As we can see here in this model of the normal spine, if you look at the spine from the side, it generally has a gentle hump in the region of the chest, and if you go to the region of the lower back, it scoops in. This gives people their natural contours when looked at from the side. However, in developmental kyphosis, we can see that the hump in the chest region is greatly exaggerated. As for what causes this condition, uh, scientists are still debating the condition, but it's thought to be a combination of both genetics and repeated microtrauma, typically from sporting events uh, such as football. And the combination of the two will cause individual vertebra, or these box, blocks of bones in the spine, to become more wedge-shaped. As multiple wedge-shaped uh, portion of the spine stack on each other, this tends to cause the entire spine to pitch forward. The good news is that most of the time, this is not a dangerous condition and requires very little treatment other than physical therapy or anti-inflammatory medications. In a few cases, however, it can become quite severe and severe kyphosis, or hunchbacking, can lead to neurological problems, such as leg problems, pain, or weakness. If something like that occurs, in general, it has to be treated through surgery, in which case we correct the spine and take it from an abnormal curved position to a straighter position. In order to determine if your kyphosis is a condition that will require surgical intervention or can be managed quite simply in a brace or with medications, please consult your spine surgeon.